Hello everybody, welcome back to Insanely Twisted Shadow Planet. Um, you might notice the thing that we got last episode is in place down here because I accidentally dropped it in. Because of course I did. And all it did was open this little way to the boss, which we're going to be fighting this episode. So yeah, I guess we'll just go right there. Mm, you're going to want this for the boss, definitely. little arena and there's the boss he's stuck in the wall right now you're gonna want to look at the ground for those like purple spots because he summons tornadoes and I already got hit but you're just gonna want to do this and pull him out and then just the normal gun's the best for this just shoot him and then he's gonna burrow into the ground and this is the real boss here There it is. It's definitely the coolest looking boss, I think. But his whole thing is that he's just gonna summon tornadoes, mechanical tornadoes, and just have to avoid them. And after he's done, he's gonna do them the other way. Kind of like hide right here. You could do it without the purple thing, but it definitely makes it a lot easier. Then he like opens up and you can pull his core out. And I'm gonna go for it. Here we go. Just break off a little layer. If it's gonna happen. There we go. It needs to get smaller. And then Tornado gets like stronger every time, so you have to definitely be easy to Oop, he does different patterns. I got hit. Luckily not all of the tornadoes actually have like a pool on you. That one, oh, but it didn't get me. Okay. Yeah, I kind of want to see him do this. Uh, there we go. Okay, here we go. Attack it again. Bounce me. And there, it got even smaller. Okay. I look, I like how the little healing things also get sucked into it. Okay. Oh my god, it's all over the place. You know, die. Okay, there we go. We'll finish with the bus off. <laughs> there we go. It just explodes and turns into this thing, which is the final ability we're gonna get. So, yeah. This is a pretty good ability. You can use it for different things, but its main thing is powering stuff. So, yeah, you can put electricity into things now. Since it makes sense because it's mechanical, you know. But, yeah, but the other thing you can use it to attack stuff, you can do this, and it makes this little, like, electric aura around you. And if you let go, it shocks all the enemies in the area. But, yeah, so I'm just gonna do that. Make it through here. And I think this is gonna take us to the next area. I guess we'll just go there, and then I'll end the episode. This can be like a little mini episode. I don't even remember the name of this area. But, uh, yeah. Next time, we'll be going through here. So, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.